Hello and welcome to The Sims 2. I know it's The Sims 2 Open for Business, but uh, I have been playing this game a lot over the past couple of years that I've had this installed. And I have my own little, <laughs> own little town here, Arbendale, which has um, Cumin Vlots businesses and stuff, and I didn't want to risk it all going wrong by uninstalling, just so I can reinstall for when it gets the other games. Anyway, this is a continuation from The Sims 1, so this is basically uh, just going to be a video looking at uh, these three towns here. We're just going to ignore open business aspect, nightlife, and university, and we're just going to hop straight into Pleasant View, which I remember back in the day, this is my second favorite one, I never played Strangeville. I think it was Veronaville that I liked the most. I'll find out, because I think Veronaville was the one with all the big houses and the rich families. And... Oh, I haven't, for some reason, I haven't actually viewed these towns since I installed Open Business. So it's just going to give us a little, little look at all the places. There's quite a lot of houses, jeez. Maybe it's just because I haven't played The Sims 1. Oh yeah, that's right as well. Uh, welcome to Sims 2 Open Business. Would you like to associate a shopping district? No, because we have no associated neighborhoods. Well, doesn't matter. Anyway, uh, welcome to Pleasant View. A lot has happened in 25 years. Mortimer Goth made his fortune. The Pleasants put down roots and a new generation of Sims was born. <clears throat> but the peaceful, happy existence is in jeopardy when some new arrivals to Pleasant View start stirring up trouble, creating rivalries and tensions for all the families in the neighborhood. Can anything be done to restore the, s the peace to sleepy, idyllic Pleasant View? Cassandra is on a family of... Uh, ready to start a family of her own, but she can she tame the town Casanova and can Mortimer bounce back after the disappearance of his wife, Bella? Oh, jeez. <laughs> Was it just coincidence that the Kelly empty sisters arrived on the eve of Bella's disappearance? And is there interest in Mortimer? Physical? Physical. Or physical, sorry. Who is Don Lothario? Is his engagement to Cassandra Goth genuine? And what about the rumor that her mother, Bella, was last seen scaling the deck of his condo? Brandy was left alone was left to raise two boys alone following her husband's suspicious pool ladder accident. With Dustin acting out, can Brandy teach young Bo to make the right choices in his life? They got a pet? Oh, he's got a rabbit, I think. I can't tell. On the surface, Daniel and Mary Sue Pleasant seem to have the perfect life, but is their love a flimsy facade? And can Angela and Lilith come, uh, make right choices when it comes to love? Darren is pursuing his dream of being an artist, while son Dirk hits the books, and Darren might have found his muse, but is created enough to win Cassandra's kind of perfection. Oh, they've got a really nice story, Scott. Jeez. So, we might as well, pleasant view, um, start off with. Uh, the pleasant. Oh, oh, geez, actually, I want to look at this house first. Oh my god. Hold up. Is this the house featured on the back of the game? Which cover is it? It is the. Um. The later re release. What year was this? This was 2000 and. Oh, it's 2006 on the back. It must be 2006. I've got, um. Hang on. Which is the 2004 one? Nope. I've got two copies of the game. 2004 with all the original discs and 2006 with just the one disc. So, I just wanted to check out this house quickly. Because, oh my god, look at that. I just don't like the fact they have archways instead of actual doors. But anyway, um, my gosh, I love this house. This is amazing. It's insanity. They have a room with just a chair and fireplace. How. <laughs> How would you even think of this? Oh my god! Part of the house is outside. Oh, Jesus, this is insanity! My god! Wait, what? This entire. Most majority of the house is outside! Jeez! Oh my god, this is amazing! Anyway, uh, let's head back. And I'm not gonna go into every single house because that would take forever. Oh, we've got families here. Uh, the Burb family. John, Jennifer, and young Lucy have decided to chase. Uh, blah, 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 blah. And the Aldi couple. And my favorite part used to always be creating one huge family, then moving them into one house. What is up with all these big buildings? Um, yeah, making one house. 
like you're one huge family and then um, moving some of them out and just having a town. I might view my one later on. But anyway, uh, we've got the Pleasant family. We've got Daniel Pleasant, Cold Fish. On the surface, Daniel and Mary Sue Pleasant seems the perfect life here. Yeah, what are they law? But Mary Sue, Lila, and Angela. I remember I did a playthrough of this game in 2014, but it's all all the videos are private. Because I did a 50 episode, 50 episode playthrough of The Sims 2. Um, yeah, back in 2014, and. It absolutely I had I killed off Daniel my sim married Mary Sue and then they both cheated on each other and then I can't even remember what happened at the end so anyway this is their house which is quite a nice place yeah I like it very nice multi-story oh, I've just got the two rooms up here wait do they, the girls share room? Oh no, there's one there. Wait, so how old? Are they twins, are they? Because they seem like twins. Ooh! She hates her family! Sneak out with Dirk. Have you seen Sneak Out? Click on the phone before midnight and choose Sneak Out. Okay, for some reason, they get along with like... So Lilith is supposed to be the... Rebellious one. Who says good help is hard to find? Daniel has his eye. Well, what? Who says good help is hard to find? Daniel has his eye on the maid and wants a little romance, but will his decision threaten family unity? Oh, these girls are fighting. <laughs> That's interesting. Don't poke, please. Let's just go to the toilet. And everyone needs to go to the toilet for some reason. And the Sims, this one, they always start needing to be kissed lightly. Okay. They all start needing to take a wee. I haven't got enough bathrooms for Daniel. Swing. Um. I want to see this. Where is the phone in the house? There it is. I don't know how to sneak out. Play on the couch. <laughs> oh, go to school. Okay, so she's a teen. Go to school. Go to work. Actually, that's probably what you did with the occupation. He's an assistant coach for the athletic career. He gets paid quite a lot. Uh, she is a an intern politics. They are public school students. Of course, Lilith is the stereotypical teenager with the rebellious streak, wanting to sneak out, and has a D minus in school. Do they have any talent badges? No, they don't. Don't code with any talent badges. All right. Um. Oh, they have a swimming pool. Nice. Um. So on that note, we will leave the pleasant family. Which, their name is obviously rather ironic. <laughs> they all seem to get along well, except with Lilith. Actually, actually sorry, I'm going to look at this house quickly, because these two houses here... I haven't played this in ages. Obviously, since I've had open business installed, which I installed that last year, I haven't looked at these towns. Okay, so this is unfurnished. It just looks... I just like the whole fact of this tower and huge section and it just fascinates me this house. So it reminds me of the British ones. Actually there's a house down the road for me that looks like that. Um Yeah, there's a house near mine that looks like this, but my god. This is a stunning house. Jeez. Alright. <clears throat> Getting distracted, I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, let's move on to... The goth. Good old goth family. Who... Mortimer is now old. Uh, Cassandra is now... Um, 
an adult, I think. And then I left got a son called Alexander. Bella is gone. It's weird playing these games consecutively, because then you start to learn the full story. Like, yeah. And I wonder if I'll... I might... Sp I'm considering splitting this into, like, three episodes. Whoa, Cassandra is smitten with Donna, wants to get hitched. Perhaps an effect affectionate gesture will put a relationship on strong footing. Um, why is this all... She wants to... We'll put Locke and get... Hang on, how strong is her marriage to her relationship to They're engaged. Kiss. Make out. Ooh, fireworks. That was quite a kiss. Cassandra, better strike while the iron is hot and get married. Alright then, let's get married. Get left at the altar. I never knew some of this stuff could happen in this game. Jeez. So I've never seen this whole story aspect. I, I really like this, the um, story games. I mean, they're quite strong. Watch. Don't play the piano. Can everyone, like, come, please? Froggy, Jahano, love. Don't, don't leave, don't leave. No, 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 no. No. Steep flow. Oh my god. Oh my god. She's gone cuckoo, and now we need a therapist. Oh, we can't see the therapist. Wait, are they going to be all upset now because they witnessed Cassandra got left in the altar? Oh my god. Lost Donna's a best friend. What are they now? Oh my god, she hates her. She hates him, I mean. Oh, that's actually really interesting. I like this twist. She looks a bit weird. Oh, that's <laughs> Now they're gonna pillow fight. All right. All right. Oh, pfft. you just got left at the altar. Boof. <laughs> All right. So this is their house. Quite a grand house. A lot, a lot grander, a lot bigger than their last. Oh yeah. It also tells you. Um, oh, I've got to look at the person's family tree. It tells you on the headstones as well. So we've got Gunther Garth, Cornelia Goth, Simon Crumplebottom, Agnes. Oh, Agnes Crumplebottom. Uh, Victor Goth and Gretel Goth. So we're going to take a look at the family tree. G Gunther Goth. Oh, Victor is his... Okay, so Victor is Gunther's dad. Gretel is his mom. Frida. I don't know what Frida is, is, but... Frida is the sister. And Cornelia is related to Agnes Crumplebottom, Simon Crumplebottom, Prudence Crumplebottom. Gunther Goth is her husband. Then we've got Mortimer. Bella doesn't exist. Oh, wait, Bella does exist. There's Bella with... Michael. Oh, Michael Bachelor. That's right. Why is Michael Bachelor dead? How could they kill him off? Simon's Bachelor. Your caster. He's married to Dina. Ca oh, he's married to Dina Caliente, who had also has an entirely dead family. Polynesian Technician Seven. Don't see a Caliente. This is this is fascinating, but extremely weird. Oh my gosh. So this is the Goths family house. Uh, three stories, nice. I like. Oh, hang on, that's four stories. Oh, because there's a telescope up here. Anyway, uh, what I'm gonna do? Cause I'm just looking through all the houses, and then I'll probably find one family. Um, to play through, depending on how much time we have. Cause you know, I might not have the time to do that. Um, I'm gonna look at the pleasants quickly. There are a lot of things to do in the game. Like I was, I had a whole, whole thing planned out for this, but I can't really show it off. The game is so open-ended. Oh yeah, so Mary Sue's got the whole. Oh, her parents are the oldies that are currently. Ah, oh, okay, I get it. Uh, Myron, Emma, Bruno. Ma is that mommy? Mammy. Okay. And then his family. Everyone's family's dead. 
But I do like so much evidence been put into this. Okay, so Jennifer Burr was his sister. John Burr. Oh, jeez. They put so much effort into this. My gosh. If only they did this now. Um, sorry, what? <laughs> Alright. Um, yeah, this game is so open-ended that I could play this for ages. I could do serious for years. I've never played with the Dreamer family before. Oops. The Dreamer family, so it'll be interesting to see. I think I've only ever played the Goths. The Brokes. That's all I remember. So he wants to see he wants to see a ghost? Oh he hates Don Lothario. That's interesting. Okay, so he does have an entire family. They're all dead. And his mother is also dead, Darlene Dreamer. That's kinda of sad. Well I mean now this is your chance, Darren. Now that Cassandra has been left at the altar. Darren wants to. Uh, Darren Jima wants to paint for a living, but to see if the skills pay the bills, those past two statements are starting to pile up. I assume there's going to be bills on the table somewhere. No, don't see what they are. Okay, so they're obviously the ones that are a bit like. Ah, oh, I like this, the whole art studio going on here. It's cute. Nice little tables. So, yeah, their house is obviously quite minimalistic, so they're obviously the ones that are, like, financially struggling. Oh, and there's... There's the headstone of his wife in the garden. It's quite dark how they have that. Anyway, um... Yeah, these are all such interesting stories that you can play through with. Uh, obviously with the Goths, it'll be the aftermath of Dom leaving Cassandra at the altar, because then we've now got, so we've gone Pleasant Goth, right next will be the Caliente family, Nina and Dina. These two, oh gosh, this would have been like the perfect soap opera. <laughs> Marry a rich sim. <laughs> so she's definitely a gold digger, Dina. And Nina wants to bang on, okay. And move out. Alrighty. So she's in l oh gosh, she absolutely loves Mortimer. What are they like family wise? They're uh, sisters, obviously. And that family are all dead and for some reason this guy has pollination <laughs> pollination signature <laughs> seven. <laughs> Wait, Bella? Oh, it says Bella's alive. That's so weird. That's the whole mystery behind her is so cool. Dina Caliente is digging for gold and wants to lay a claim on Mortimer. Don't wait for him to make the big move. Be aggressive. Oh, don't stop fighting, you two. This is really nice of this, huh? Um, the houses here are so, uh, really interesting. So, who gets the small bed? <laughs> this is a really interesting house. Weird colouring, and this huge space here, which is quite empty. Yeah, these houses are so interesting. Because they're just so out there. There's Mosma. Um, yeah, I'll save. Yeah, so what I'm planning to do for this is sort of just show off all of the locations and then university sort of go into gameplay because that has more of like a story to it. This is so open-ended. I don't know when I would stop. I'd stop 10 episodes in 15, 25, would I go 50 again? Cause that took forever. But um, yeah, Lothario, Don Lothario. <laughs> oh, Don. Let's see. I'm gonna see if this actually lost Cassandra's a best friend. Ooh! Had an affair with. Oh my god. Hold up. Okay, so they have like the whole sort of thing. Adriana died in a 
Nicola died. Christina, for the first time, fell in love with me. Oh, jeez. Got struck by lightning. Oh, well, I guess that's supposed to be the joke there. Got a job. Got rejected from... Got rejected with makeout with Bella. So he went from Bella to... He's... Oh, my gosh. They really went with Cassandra with him. And then he thanked her. Got rejected for public work with Caitlin. And then, and then later accepted, fell in love with Cassandra, got a promotion. Then they got engaged, and he's sort of like, oh no. Then jilted her at the altar. Made out with Nina, met Mortimer, met, uh, made out with Cassandra, lost her as a best friend. Sorry, I'm going to have to ignore that in the background. Um, So, does she hate... Oh, he doesn't hate her. It's weird, but they've lost everything. Dom's romantic life is really humming along. Now's the time to put out, put the moves on Nina Caliente, pick up the phone to invite her over. Um... His house is a mess. He's going to dance. Um, um, yeah, that's the thing. Be rejected for a flip by cause oh, for God's sake. Woohoo with three different sims. Oh, jeez, they've coded him really well to be an ass. <laughs> and I think we've got one more family left. Thario. And there's all loads of loads of places for sale, loads of businesses. I like how they've got little car parks. We can look at those in a minute. We're gonna go with the broke family. Quickly. I like the whole um joke about well not a joke. Whole reference to the missing pool ladder. And I think there was speculation about Brandy killing her husbands. Because that's a really small pool. Very small, very small. For some reason, they've got a lot of shrubs in this garden area. Um, see, this is their house. Bo just sits in the sits in the corner, and I'm pretty sure she's unemployed. Let's go into memories. Quit job. Okay, so let's go. So she's got the whole. Whoa, hold up, Betty newbie. Don't tell me they've killed off, killed off Bob and Betty. <laughs> Bob Senior, Simkovich. Okay, so Betty, they have killed off Bob and Betty. Oh my God! Flat broke. <laughs> Skip broke. Oh, that's cool. But they killed off Bob and Betty. How could they? So all this learn to talk from Bob. That's quite cool. Grew up well. Grew up well. Is that? And she kissed Skip. And she grew up well. And she fell in love with him. Got engaged. Got a job as something culinary. Got married. Did woohoo. Bob died. Got promotion. Then Betty died. Had Dustin. Body trained Dustin. Dustin grew up well. Skip died. Dustin grew up badly. Oh no, so that's what's going on now, is it? Skip died, grew up badly, Bird joined the family, made best friends with Angela, lost a fight, went, st went steady with Angela. Okay, that's interesting. And baby set her memories here. So what's the message going to be here? Bu Bo Broke is going up, growing up fast, and Brandy wants to teach him all the skills he needs to stay out of trouble. Click on Bo to teach him to walk and satisfy skills for both sims. Alrighty. Get the report card. Get busted. <laughs> I didn't. I've never noticed these things. Probably because I was always fascinated with the the house building aspect, like the whole building aspect and stuff in this. But um, what I'm actually gonna do, because it's easier, I'm gonna take Don. Cause not gonna lie, as much as I hate him, I actually quite like Don. <laughs> He's just going to use the toilet quickly. I say I much prefer this game over the Sims, like out of all the Sims games. Oh, call taxi. Let's give a dance like a bit of a weirdo. We're going to go to 250 Main Street. 
No, stop dancing. Let's go. Oh, hold on. I forgot to check out Dom's house. So, his is basically... His is just about... Was well, very similar to the Kellyantes, except his house is a bit less... A bit less uh, wild, let's say. And it's smaller. But that's actually quite dark. That all of these sims here, basically all of their families are dead. Like, there's just the two families in the family bin. And then other than those two and everyone else in the town, the rest are like dead, except Bella, because there's the whole mystery behind her disappearance. Which is very cool. Um, this is interesting music. This is I don't even know what this is. Is this supposed to be some sort of Recreation center? I think so. Because that would make sense with being able to buy drinks and stuff. I think it is. It's quite cool. It just doesn't make too much sense to me. Oh, but this is cool. The little makeshift car park. I wish nightlife that. Um, with the introduction of actual like driver drive level, uh, with the introduction of vehicles, the cars would like pull in and park in like these, like these were actual car parks instead of just design. Because these are the same uh, things as the road here. But and that's done. Call taxi. These places get so in depth. Oh no, he's met someone new. Who did he meet? Okay, he met Kennedy. Okay, he's not likely. To want to woohoo with Kennedy by the looks of things. Be poked by Oh, there's Darren. Darren likes Cassandra, so obviously he's gonna poke me. Joy Buzzer, just to be mean. He's not gonna like that. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, he hates us now. Okay, is the taxi coming? We want to go to... We'll try out 290 Main Street next. <laughs> I'm kind of tempted to do massive playthrough of all these characters and just develop their stories, maybe over like a couple episodes. Actually, let me know if you'd if you'd see if you'd want to watch that. I'd quite like to do something with Dom and the Kellyantes. Perhaps once I've finished playing through all this stuff. Like, uh, looking at all the expansions and stuff, and I've got nothing else to do. Perhaps I'll do that. Play through with these sims and... Feud with the... the goths. I'll pick, like, a couple sims and develop their stories. Like, feud with the goths. Stuff with the Kalanti sisters. Oh my gosh, why have I thought of an entire... Entire thing already. Okay, so this is your market. I'm pretty sure this is where you buy games from. Yep, there's the herbs, there's Skate, and there's some city of Russia. It's quite cool. I reckon these two would get along well. They should be double X, or not. Hopefully he didn't flirt. Okay, silently scream laugh. So there's a supermarket here, or cute little, cute little shop here. Okay, that didn't go on well. Flat. I want to get this some spots now. I've got the console version, but um, I haven't got my recording device I haven't got the plug to be able to play that with because you need a certain plug for consoles that require AV cables and my plug I don't know where it is it's up at my friend's house somewhere I'm gonna try find it um 
in any way I want to play through. Uh, more of my PC games first. They're always easy to record. Here we go. Oops. 350 Main Street. Or 330, whatever. Good community lock. Again with this. This is nice. I really like this. It's so cool. Anyway, let's head on. <laughs> You'll just go water random plants, because why not? Okay. What is this up here? Oh, that's a deck. That's a huge. That looks huge. Okay, so this is just like a clothes shop. I don't even know. This is a mess. <laughs> and then upstairs is some sort of bathroom for some weird reason. I don't get it. But anyway, I'm just gonna actually gonna go to neighborhood. Um, yeah, that's all good. I'm just gonna go check out the last place, which is a park somewhere, wherever that is, where is it, where is the park, there's an entire lot there, nice, Woodland Park, <clears throat> alright, this is Woodland Park, Woodland, 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 Alright. Oh, and page up. There we go. This is quite cool. This is really cool, actually. It's really nice. Jeez. I love it. Especially the little bridge over here. That's really cool. It's just amazing. The Sims 2 is still amazing. Like, jeez. Um, even in 2020, imagine if this had, if this had like, if this had updated graphics and 2020 graphics and such, this would be mind blowing game in 2020. But anyway, uh, yes, that is Pleasant View. Still got the Aldi family and the the Burb family. Uh, who was related to the Burbs? It wasn't. No, it wasn't Skip. Someone was related to the Burps. But I like how this, all the families here are related. It'd just be cool if they're related to some of the ones in, like, Veranaville, stuff like that. Uh, what's the other one called? Oh my god, Strange Town. But anyway, yes, uh, I'm going to end this video. I uh, hope you enjoyed taking a look at The Sims 2. The rainbow! Um, yes, in the next episode, I'll be taking a look at Strange Town, which gets really messed up. So, hope you'll, hope you'll watch and see how really messed up it is. Alright.